So this is a uh, basket weave for prevention of inversion ankle sprains. Inversion ankle sprain would be moving the foot into this direction. This is where 80% of your sprains occur. And so you want to start with pre-wrap. And you always want to wrap from away from the heart towards the heart. You want to start at the metatarsal heads, the base of the toes, and work your way up to the base of the calf. Now I'm going to grab my Shock Doctor Elite Athletic Tape and I want to lay down three anchors. Now when you place your first anchor, you're going to start up high. Um, the calf, which is the gastrocnemius, is wider than the ankle and so you want to angle it. Put about an inch onto the skin, right in the midline of the lower leg and just gently apply pressure as you pull up and you lay down your first anchor strip. You want to apply three of these, splitting the tape right in half and then flattening out your angle as you go down. Now we want to place an anchor strap on the base of the foot and we want to pull, start on the medial side, the inside part of the foot, right over the arch and we want to pull the arch in an upward direction and just lightly lay the tape down and laying it flat. Now what we want to do is we actually want to weave a basket that protects the subtalar joint here starting from the inside of the leg which is the medial side and working your way to the outside of the leg your first strip actually goes right over the malleolus, which is the bump on the medial side of your leg. And with a moderate amount of pressure, pull up to the lateral side, flatten out your tape. Now you'll want to apply a horseshoe, which goes down to the base of the foot, around the calcaneus, or the heel bone, and then pull it flat on the lateral or the outside of the foot. And you're going to alternate these strips, stirrup to horseshoe. Go in front of the tape, angle it to where you're going over the middle at the bottom, pull up on the outside in the opposite direction. And we want to continue with this pattern with our Elite Athletic Tape, another horseshoe, splitting the Elite Athletic Tape in half, pulling around to the lateral side, and just gently applying. And then our final stirrup starting posterior or the back side of the top, shooting down at an angle towards the base of the foot, and pulling in opposition on the opposite side or the lateral side. And then one final horseshoe. Apply an anchor strip over the top to hold the tape down. And then we want to apply a very light anchor point back over the midfoot. Now I'm going to transition over to the Hybrid Athletic, which we've colored blue just to give you a point of reference. Where the Shock Doctor Hybrid Athletic Tape is innovative is it has a little stretch to it. This provides the support and strength of white tape, but allows the conformity we need to get around some of the specific anatomy of the, of the ankle. First thing I'm going to do is apply what's called a figure eight. I'm going to put the tape right above that bump called the malleolus and I'm going to shoot for the bottom of the foot and I'm just going to make the number eight all the way around like so. What the hybrid athletic tape allows us to do, it allows us to go around these complex angles and it allows conformity and so you don't have any wrinkles and with wrinkles we get blisters. With blisters we're not comfortable and the tape loses its function. So we maintain the neutral position of the foot by applying the figure eight and the final two strips that we'll apply are our heel locks. So doing a proper heel lock, and this is to lock the calcaneus or the heel bone into place. Again, start just above that medial malleolus, or the bump on the inside of the ankle. Come down, instead of coming towards the toes, now you're gonna to go towards the heel on the back side, and you're gonna to try to capture that heel on the medial side and pull it right back to where you started it from. And it lays nice and flat. Now I'm going to do the same thing on the opposite side. Start above the lateral malleolus, dive down around the back of the calcaneus, back to my starting point. This serves to control the movement of the calcaneus and so preventing that subtalar joint from coming apart inside the mortise. And I'll finish closing up the, uh, the basket weave with my Elite Athletic Tape. And this provides the greatest amount of support for this tape job. 
I can also finish with the Hybrid Athletic, or I can uh, finish with the Elite Stretch, which allows me the greatest mobility. So to finish this tape job off, we want to make sure we close up any windows that are exposed. And so starting at the top of the foot and lightly going around the posterior ankle, we're going to cut the tape in half each time, making sure we eliminate any gaps. And as we work our way up, we'll have a complete preventative tape job provided by our shock doctor combination of elite athletic and hybrid athletic tapes.